Hi, my name is Vicki Baxter and I am uh, the local chapter representative for Black Educators Rock in Buffalo, New York. And if you are watching this, you are probably part of the Black Educators Rock Facebook page. And what I'd like to do is just take a few minutes to tell you a little bit about my experience with Black Educators Rock. I'd like to tell you about membership and I'd like to tell you about our upcoming conference. I do have notes, so if you see me going back to the side, back and forth, um, please forgive me for that. This is the first time I've ever done a video. But as part of the leadership team, we were asked to share our experiences um, about Black Educators Rock. So let me just start off by telling you about myself. Um, I am a veteran teacher. I have worked in a public school for 23 years and I'm a special education teacher. So special education teachers, I need you to sh truly show up and show out at this conference. Um, my daughter let me know about the Black Educators Rock Facebook page when it got started. And we were very, very excited about it. Um, and it was very special because for the first time, we literally had something that was for us, created by us, and relevant to us. As educators, we face a lot of challenges. Um, we face challenges um, with the students, with the parents, with the administrators, with our coworkers, and with society because they don't value educators and what we really do and what we mean to the, the, I guess the community that we serve. So this Facebook community finally gave us a place where we could inspire one another, we could encourage one another, we could share ideas, and we could sometimes just come in and say, I got this going on, anybody experience this, can you help me? And we were a true support one to another. And the Facebook page is absolutely wonderful, but I just want to take it a step further. That's fine. That's great. But sometimes we need some help with skin on it. And that's where the local chapters come in. That's where the state representatives come in. And that's where the national organization comes in because we are here for you, just for you. So let me talk about the conference. My daughter and I, who was an educator in Maryland, her experience is, you know, in Maryland, there are a lot of black people that are doing well. In Buffalo, we have black people doing well. We have some black teachers. However, in my building, I was the only black teacher. So to be able to go to a conference where there are educators and there are black people and the thing that impressed me, so many people had PhDs and they were doctor this and doctor that. And I was like, wow, this is really incredible. I am truly surrounded by black magic. I am surrounded by black excellence. I am surrounded with black girl excellence and black, I don't want to say boy excellence, but you get the drift. Um, I saw men that just held themselves with honor and, 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 and esteem and integrity and humility. And I saw women who were just a force to be reckoned with. And they were just amazing in their own right and the things that they have created and they have done. Um, we touch things from curriculum to uh, self-care to um, you know, the importance of our, our profession and, and why having black teachers it's so important because children need to see a reflection of themselves in the classroom, in the world. And they can't just be um, athletes because there are black scholars, but we are so well hidden that nobody knows we exist. So it appears as if our culture is lacking and just being able to make a difference. Um, a, a, another conference 
theme, they talked about Africa and they talked about the creations of Africa and the inventions and the scientists and, you know, just the great things that we've done. And I, and I remember leaving feeling proud that I was an educator, but feeling more proud that I was a black educator and I was surrounded by other black educators that got me. So I really want to encourage you to come experience the life changing environment that black educators rock has to offer. You don't want to miss this year's conference. I'm going to get my paper because like I said, I don't want to mess this up and I'm going to put on my glasses so that I can make sure I'm seeing it correctly. But um, our conference is going to be in Jacksonville, Florida this year. Um, we're going to be staying at the Doubletree Hotel. And the conference dates are from July 12th to July 15th. My birthday is July 12th. So last year started the day after my birthday. And it was just, it was just part of my birthday celebration just to be surrounded by so many great people. The cost, if you pay by the end of this month, March 31st, is $199. After March 31st, you're going to have to pay the $250. Now, if you have ever gone to any type of professional development, any conference outside of your district, you know this is a bargain. You don't spend this kind of money um, or this, you don't get the value um, at the the type of money that we're, we're offering. And, and we do it because we want to make it affordable for us to show up and others, because although it's, it is Black Educators Rock, it is the Rock Conference. And it is for teachers who, and educators who teach children of color to be able to get strategies, to be able to get um, information, to get uh, cultural, um, competence regarding children of color and how to teach them, how to instruct, how to work with their parents, how to um, like maneuver the system for, for teachers to be able to, you know, how do I deal with this difficult parent? How do I deal with this child? How do I connect? How do I deal with this? How do I deal with that? It's absolutely amazing. And all your questions, many of your questions will be answered. So I want you to go to rockconference.org. That's R-O-C-K-C-O-N-F-E-R-E-N-C-E dot org. I tell you, you don't want to miss it. Um, it has been absolutely amazing every single time. You know, at the end of the school year, you are so tired, you are exhausted. You don't even know if you want to teach anymore. You may just want to decide to, let me just walk dogs. Let me go work at McDonald's. It's got to be a lot easier than this. But you know, education is an honorable profession. And we need educators just like you to stay in the field. Our children need to see us. And we need to get the strength and the support and the inspiration to be able to do what we do and to do it well. We need the professional development. We need to talk about advocacy. We need to talk about self-care. We need to talk about staying in the race. Um, last year's conference was just so powerful and inspirational and, and, and spiritual at the same time because people really spoke to my spirit as well as my mind. So the next thing I want to talk to you about is membership. A membership has its privileges. Being a part of a national organization is very important for your resume, as well as important to staying connected and getting information and what's current and what's going on in the field of education. It allows you to have a place to go if you have a question or a concern. Um, it allows you to be able to network with other educators that can help you solve a problem, make your next move, let you know what's available, and to keep you just kind of on the forefront of what's happening in our field. 
Um, the networking piece of black education of black educators rock is so important. So consider becoming a member. Membership is only $50 per year. Um, just think about it. The value of a national membership for educators, what that could mean to you. Um, if you break it down monthly, it's little or nothing. Sorry, my, I'm getting a call. Um, so go to rockconference.org and register as well as get your membership. If you have any questions, look up Black Educators Rock on the internet. We're more, much, much more than a Facebook page. So I hope to see you July 12th through 15th in Jacksonville, Florida for the Rock Conference. Hang in there, guys. We can do this and we need each other.